We're seeing some great action here today at the Formula Seniors race. It looks like Eric Schultz of Team Black Ghost is about to take the lead. Come on, come on. But wait a minute, Red Fury of Drakers has jumped out in front. No, last. Red Fury is now dominating this race. I'm having flashbacks to when these two veteran drivers were just starting out. Their early races were legendary. It looks like Red Fury is about to give the Drakers another victory. Come on, oh. Red Fury! That's it! That's it! Bring it home! What a thrilling race! And while the two frontrunners are competing for the top spot on the podium, the driver who crosses the finish line first will win the seniors division at the Super Trophy in Greenland! This race is tightening up as third, fourth, and fifth places are starting to gain some momentum. Yeah! Oh, okay, I thought. Eric Schultz is nearly neck and neck with Red Fury. It's almost the last lap of the Formula Seniors, and Eric Schultz for Team Black Ghost shouldn't be counted out yet. Look for him to surprise the Drakers with a sudden move. Red, try to keep Eric at bay. Concentrate. Last lap here, Sandra. You've got it. Stay focused. scare there as he almost let the race get away from him. The Black Ghost pulled ahead, but not for long. This is it. Just relax. Red Fury of Team Drakers crosses the finish line and wins the Formula Seniors Division of the Greenland Super Trophy. Ah! Red today was a major victory. What makes the Drakers such strong competitors in the Formula Seniors division? There's still a long season to go, but the Drakers are a team that works together. Did anyone else inspire this win? Well... <laughs> I guess you could say I was a little more motivated more than usual this time around. But it's always been about the fans. Modest as usual. Now let's talk to the other big star today, Eric Schultz. What a great race. Red, you made a textbook fake to the right when you were really close to the curb. Two inches, awesome. Thank you, my young friends. I've also been a big fan of yours. No way, Red Fury's a fan of ours? Could I have your autograph? <laughs> huh? You're the new Formula Kids drivers for Drakers. Am I right? Good luck. Okay then, I'll sign this autograph, but I want yours. To Chris and Fabri, races of the future. With pride and admiration, Red Fury. Red Fury likes <laughs> me! <laughs> so this is where you've been. I've been looking everywhere for you two. Hector, have you found out anything new about Bob and Luke yet? Hmm. What are Bob and Luke Rivera doing in Japan? The two missing Drakers drivers were spotted near a tea right? garden west of Tokyo. Are we sure it's really them in this picture? I had the same misgivings, Chris. It seems we may have a red herring. Do you think it's a doctored photograph? So they quit Drakers and head for Japan on the eve of a big race, but they tidied their rooms first? Maybe someone snuck in later and disposed of the evidence. And a photo like this could have been staged to throw off anyone looking for them. I don't think Bob and Luke Rivera left of their own free will. I think they've been kidnapped. Kidnapped? Kidnapped? Maybe someone wanted to prevent the Rivera brothers from competing for Team Drakers, so they put them on ice somewhere. Bob and Luke might be in danger. Before you say anything to Sandra about this, I need to do some detective work. Not satisfied, Miss Duval. 
When I asked you to stir things up a little, I was hoping for something more dramatic. Listen, Gotan, we both know that the Drakers are a strong, close-knit unit. I did my best under the circumstances. What I need is a sensational scoop that will rock the foundation of the okay. Drakers permanently. Yesterday's win in the seniors division was just the beginning. Today, I want to make it a double victory for the Drakers. The cars are tuned up and all ready to go. We've improved the structural stability. G-Force won't be no problem at all. And thanks to that bonus x raw fuel, they'll be unstoppable. If only the Rivera brothers could see these modifications, Sandra. Hmm. Uh. And here come our two champions now. Good morning, everyone. Just in time. We're about to find out who your fifth opponent will be. Well, racing fans, this is where you, the audience, decide which of these Formula Kids racers will start in fifth place. Will it be Stan Murphy of Team Hurricane, Lolly or Kabir of the Tigers, or Cliff Gibbon of the Black Ghost? Yay! Click OK to vote for your favorite racer. We have our results. The driver chosen to take part in the final round will be Lolly Suri of the Tigers. As you may recall, four drivers moved on to the next round, but we let you, the audience, pick it's the fifth and final contestant. Ah. Anything to say to your fans out there? I won't let any of you down. I'm gonna win. Mm. You know, I'm really glad you're back in the race. You deserve it. Much more than those smack talkers from Drakers. Those smack talkers? Oh, sorry. I thought you knew what they've been saying about us, babe. What have they been saying? You mean you haven't heard what Chris said about you? Why no? Go on. Oh, well, here they come. Hey, look, there's Lolly and Tony now. And that's not all. He said we should go over and congratulate her. Hmm. <laughs> hmm? Hey, Congratulations, Lolly. We Lolly. wanted to. Mm -hmm. So you think I'm a kitten with no claws, is that it? Hmm? What are you talking about? At least have the courage huh? to say that to my face, Chris Bravo. Lolly, there's some kind of misunderstanding here. You keep out of this. I'm not going to waste any more of my time chatting with second-rate drivers from Drakers. Hey, we came over to congratulate you for winning audience choice. Yeah, and I'm the Queen of England. If I'm competing in Formula Kids, it's because I deserve it, Chris Bravo. Lolly's got a point. We earned our way into this. You guys just happen to be lucky. You know, if the Rivera brothers hadn't have vanished, you wouldn't be here. <laughs> We just received word that the Rivera brothers were spotted in Tokyo. While the world was wondering what has happened to Bob and Luke, our sources tell us that a rift developed between the Riveras and the Drakers. So the boys left for Japan while they weigh their next career options. Who knows what team they'll be racing for next, but one thing what? is clear, it won't be for Team what? Drakers. Our sources have speculated that the Rivera brothers may be insulted by the Drakers' decision to choose two inexperienced unknowns to fill their spots. Some see it as a slap in the face to everything that the Rivera brothers what have accomplished. The? I'm sure that Drakers fans will feel betrayed if this story is... Uh, uh. Nobody was more loyal to the Drakers than Bob and Luke Rivera. Margot has gone too far this time. A story like this could seriously damage everything Bob, Luke, and I have done to build our reputation. I'm Wait. going to... Huh? We can't let people think the team is unraveling. We must maintain a dignified silence. Huh. Hmm. Huh? Hmm. But that doesn't mean we have to pretend like nothing's happened. We should put all of our efforts into the investigation, not feuding with the press. What about their parents? I spoke with them. They're besieged by journalists. I've asked them not to comment until they hear from me. But they must be worried sick. That's not the impression that I got. Hector's right. He'll handle this. Let's stay focused on winning this next race. <laughs> Everything is ready. Which driver will achieve X Racer? The last race in the Super Trophy of Greenland is about to begin. Heading to the starting line on track three are Chris Bravo and Fabri Morelli of Team Drakers.
Let's have a round of applause for the five wonderful contestants in this race. Okay? Go drinkers! Let's race, see some race, 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 oh driving. Go. go team, go! <laughs> been a lot of controversy about Drakers in the news lately, but today it's all about the race. Activate X Racer! We are the Drakers! Start ignition! Hello, Chris. Hello, Fabri. Contact and setup is complete. Lolly's got a point. We earned our way into this. You guys just happen to be lucky. You know, if the Rivera brothers hadn't have vanished, you wouldn't be here. Well, we'll see about that. Chris, Fabry, get ready. The pace car is good to go. Two laps behind the safety car before we can see our drivers hit speeds of more than 300 miles per hour. This is track three of the ice circuit, and it's been designed to allow almost unthinkable speed. The safety car is preparing to leave the track as our drivers get ready to race. And they're off. Listen to those powerful engines roar. to slip between us. Are you ready there with Scheme D? I'm ready. Ah! Now! Ah! The jet stream Chris and Fabry just created by crisscrossing like that helps to slow Parker down. Looks like the Drakers boys ah! have some new tricks up their sleeves. Honey, stop trying to go between them. You're putting too much stress on your engine. Okay, boss. Time for a change of strategy. Chris Bravo is out in front, followed by Morelli. Parker's in third, and Lolly Suri is in fourth place. Tony Parker is gaining momentum and leaving poor Lolly Suri of the Tigers behind. Parker has set his sights on overtaking Fabri Morelli. They're neck and neck, and the suit to be disgraced Drakers are in trouble. Listen, Tony, now is the time to use a rush X card. Get ready to dance, Fabri Morelli. X card rush, stunning charge. Danger, tires compromised by 60%. Fabry, the Avanti has been modified to withstand severe G-force effects. The next time Parker hits you with his X-card power, drift to the left to conserve your tire strength. Drift now! Uh, I couldn't! I was going too fast! Whoa! The Avanti's tires are losing their grip! We might see a crash! Parker's attacks have been merciless. Fabry may be out of this race. You hate to see a young man with such promise go down like this so early in the race. For Fabry Morelli of Team Drakers, the race ends here. Vehicle compromise. Require immediate track assistance. That was a dirty shot. Parker's not supposed to use an X car before entering a curve. If regulations forbid it, Fabry may get a second chance. That's for the judges to decide. We're still in the lead. Our hopes are riding on you, Chris. Chris, you need to maintain your position. Watch for the pace car to lead you onto the next track. I'm sorry, Fabry. I'll make Parker pay for this. It can happen to anyone. Today, it happened to you. 
I don't know. Maybe they're right. We're just too young, too green. Tisk tisk. Such a shame. Are you referring to what happened to Fabri Morelli? Actually, I was thinking about that girl. What's her name? Ha 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 ha. Ah, yeah, Nina. What about Nina? I've seen how you look at her. It's obvious you have feelings for her, but are too scared huh? to do anything about them. You are a bit old for her, I agree. I don't see how any of this concerns you. Well, there she is, right over there. Why don't you go ask her out? I'm not ready yet. A wise move. She's obviously humoring you. Listen, man, I've got way too many things going on right now, so just cool it. I don't have time for a relationship. Positive? That's the way it is. Then I'm sure you won't mind if I invite Nina to dinner one of these nights. And why should I? Glad to hear it. So, what did I miss? The yellow light is out, indicating that the drivers must reduce their speed. The drivers must maintain their current positions. The pit crews are ready to go out there and make any necessary repairs. Vehicles are allowed one tire change. Even though it's a few laps early in the race for this sort of thing, Fabry's accident necessitates that they do this now. Whoa! Whoa. A few more laps and we'll know the winner of the Super Trophy of Greenland. Formula Kids division, that is. This is almost a rerun of what we saw in the Formula Seniors division. Team Black Ghost against Team Drakers. Shadow, are you ready? Ready to immobilize Marin. Racing for attack from position two. Tony Parker. Tony's uh, setting a trap. Use a defense X card. You bet I will. Okay, here goes. X card defense, jammer effect. X card defense, foggy drift. No, my X card isn't working. Tony launched his X card a split second before you. It disabled yours. We're coming up to the last lap, and Tony Parker is crushing the Drakers. Payback time. Say goodnight, Bravo. Come on, Drakers. Let's go, Drakers. If you keep flooring it like this, Chris, you're going to risk spinning out. Think strategy, not revenge. Bravo took that turn a little fast. Parker's closing in. No! Uh -huh. Front tire, pressure drop. The shadow of the Black Ghost, Tony Parker, crosses the finish line first, followed by Chris Bravo of Drakers. Third, Lolly Suri of the Tigers. Tony Parker of the Black Ghost has handed his team the Super Trophy of Greenland in the Formula Kids division. The Drakers still lead the rankings, but we might be seeing that lead beginning to erode as internal controversy threatens to affect their performance on the track. Yeah! Yeah, Drakers! Yeah, Drakers! Drakers can feel Team Black Ghost breathing down their necks as this race gets tighter than ever. This is Margo signing out. Those guys Bravo and Morelli are just bringing the Drakers down. No wonder Bob and Luke quit. It was a rough day, Fabri, but we'll start tomorrow with a clean slate. Once we figure out what really happened to Bob and Luke Riviera, everything will work out. You'll see. Better get some sleep. Thank you for the private jet. I'd rather congratulate you in person than over the phone. My compliments, Margo. <laughs> we dealt quite a blow to the Drakers. <sighs> A lethal one, like a snake bite. Mm. 
There's just one thing I can't figure out. How did Tony Parker know which X card I was going to use? What do you think, Fabri? Huh? Fabri? Translator! Hello, Fabri. Hello, Avanti. Are you crying? I'm sorry, it's all my fault. I'm built for this kind of punishment. Maintenance is required before I am fully functional. I don't know what came over me. I should have listened. You told me what to do and I didn't listen. There will be other races. No, maybe not for me. I thought about it. Thought about what, Fabri Morelli? I don't think I'm cut out for racing. The Drakers can look for a new driver.